What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video. Today I am extremely excited because we have finally reached 1,000 subscribers here on my channel. And I just wanted to take a minute to say thank you for all of your love and support because without all of you guys, I wouldn't have gotten here. And I know it is only 1,000 subscribers and everybody says that the first 1,000 subscribers that you get is the hardest. And believe me, I know I am slowly approaching my four years here on YouTube. But if you guys look back at my original content from four years ago, the quality and the videos themselves are not necessarily the greatest. But with the hard work that I've put in, your love and support as well, and me learning everything on my own on how to edit my videos better, make better content, record, plan videos, make my thumbnails. It has gotten me to where I am today. So thank you guys for all of your love and support. I have a bunch of new videos planned for the future, but I'm also looking at previous content that I created, seeing what you guys enjoyed me to do the most. And I might try to make more of the content I made in the past for the future, but only the content that I absolutely love to create. Because like I've said before, if I don't enjoy the content that I'm creating and putting out on YouTube, there's no point in me doing it. If I want to continue doing the videos and making the videos, I want to make sure it's the videos that I absolutely want to make and I love to create. And as long as I believe the final product was good, I will upload it onto my channel. Whether or not that generates views, we will see, time will tell, but so far it has been doing pretty good some of my previous videos, so I can't wait to see what is happening next. I have a lot of new videos planned, a lot of new series planned, so I just wanted to take a minute and say thank you for coming along this journey. I know I've had a stressful year, all of us has, with COVID-19, but I just wanted to take a second and say thank you guys, because if it wasn't for you, I would not have made it to 1,000 subscribers. So at least I know that since we reached 1,000 subscribers, I feel like I'm doing something right. So thank you guys for everything. New videos coming very soon. I'm going to continue to do the Tuesday and Saturday videos. And then moving into September, I plan on doing a video every Tuesday, Saturday, and I think I'm going to do Thursdays as well. I'm going to have an extra video. So I'm going to go back to three videos a week as opposed to my current two videos a week. And I've done two videos a week for the past year or almost two years. So to get back into three videos a week, it's going to be exciting. And I can't wait to bring you along with the journey moving forward. Now that I'm at 1,000 subscribers, what does that mean for me? Well, I've already reached the 4,000 watch hours in the last year. I've reached that months ago, and it's been continuously getting good views. So now that I'm at 1,000 subscribers, I technically can apply to get ads on the channel, which I am going to be doing so. However, I just wanted to let you guys know, I'm not going to flood the channel with tons of ads. I'm going to go and put it mainly the ads on my most viewed videos every month. But I'm not going to flood every single video with multiple ads throughout the video. There's no points. Any money that my ads generate for my channel, I'm going to take that money and I'm going to put it back towards the channel. So unboxings, taste tests, things that personally I haven't been able to do in a really long time because the funds have not been there. If I can generate just a little bit of income through my YouTube channel moving forward, now that I'm at the partnership line, I guess, where you can have a thousand subscribers, 4,000 watch hours in the past year, and then get ads on your channel. If I generate just a little bit of income with that, I'm putting it right back in the channel for you guys. I'm not going to be pocketing any of it because to me, that's not fair. If I want to continue to make better and better contents, I need to put it forward on the channel. So that means also putting into a year subscription for TubeBuddy, which I currently use but I'll be able to put a little bit more of that instead of coming out of my pocket, it'll come out of the channel directly. And also where I make my thumbnails and edit my videos, I'll be able to use the YouTube income for that instead of out of my pocket as well. But also anything from YouTube, I'm also gonna be looking towards unboxing videos, taste tests and things like that. Or if there's anything else you guys wanna see me do in the future, let me know down in the comments below. But once again, thank you for all of your love and support. I wouldn't have gotten here without you. So I'm going to leave this video here. Please take care. Peace.